As the global village is expanding, so is the need of communication. Consequently, translation industry is expanding, while the tools for achieving a certain format of text in target language are also developing. Therefore, the concept of computer-assisted translation, in, in short CAT, was created and here for many programs. One of the first tools created was WordFast, which is still used. It also outset overrides an, uh, any formatting elements, placing tags instead, while the translation is made in a table with a column for source and target text. A very simple and convenient version of WordFast is also WordFast Anywhere, which is similar with uh, this one, uh, which is a free online tool. In about the same time, Trados was released. Typical, Trados is using Word and it runs a set of macros that allow segments to open, close and save the translation unit in the, in the translation memory. Similar to Trados and also, and also calling translation memory from uh, Translato's workbench is Tag Editor. It's a standalone software that it is still very popular among translators due to its ability to ignore formatting and graphing elements and to insert tags. In the same Trados package, another software uh, that was included uh, is SDLX. Having a layout that suits uh, the modern appro approach of CAT tools with two columns, it also accepts a higher number of formats, having in addition the ability to split large files and merge them back. This feature, together with the ability of using translation memory as access format, uh, made it very popular among team of translators. In 2009, SDL launched SDL Trado Studio, a developed version of the previous SDL Trado Synergy, which emphasizes the concept of a project, including in one place translation memory, term bases, used for glossary, reference, and also improved the ability to use online resources. The version released in 2011 was significantly improved, while the newest version, Studio 2012, 2014, promises to be even better. In the same year, 2009, another tool created by Hungarian Kilgrave team was released on the market during the annual virtual conference for translators. Considered one of the most versatile computer-assisted tools, MemoQ can not only deal with probably the highest number of formats needed to be translated, but it is also able to import files and whole packages of many other translation tools. Uh, it can import transit packages uh, as well as studio packages, but as individual files it can uh, import TXML word files, files and many others due to its extensive filter. A particular feature uh, of this tool is called Live Docs and has the ability of using bilingual files as translation memories, retrieving the translation in the new document to be translated. Other developers found exciting the idea of translating online in real time for the benefit of not only one translator, but of an entire team of translators. Conversely, Across released a version that is free for translators, which access client server upon a key and a password, and the translation memory is enriched almost instantaneously by each translator involved. Across is preferred to each large number of formats accepted, but it needs significant resources for working properly on translator's machine. Following both the concept of embedded resources and modern layout, with two columns for source and target, there are also other key players on the market.
Transit 15, previously Transit Star, uses packages both for retrieving the translation and for delivering it. Transit is compact with visible uh, long tags, but it can incorporate all the files of a package in just one document, so the translator won't need to open each file for accessing the content. Among the important actors of the scene of the translation industry, there are, of course, some other tools preferred by certain clients and translators. More used are Pasolo, which has the ability to translate software interface, DejaView, which lost some of its popularity, Idiom, Catalyst, and some smaller and not some sophisticated tools such as Poedit, or uh, Leaf, or T-Stream, or Qt Linguist, or Easy Translate. There is a certain tool for every preference and format file, while the perfect tool that has all the desired feature was not created, and it is unlikely it will be developed to fit all the needs and preferences.